Sonic Brawler slash Wii Hex tutorials here with Cheat Engine and Sonic Adventure 2 with Steam. Um, this just is showing some stuff that um, Leon and Zodi and I made and found and other stuff. But the shout out is, but no one's uploading a tutorial on that, so I will skip that. First up, I will just show you something really cool. It's no clip. You press N, and then you can just move around anywhere. So go up, press U and up, go down, press U and down. So you can get out of here just like in the original Sonic Adventure 2 and Sonic Adventure 2 Battle. Um, so you can grab a chow, jump up, no clip, fly through here or whatever. And then the chow is stuck in me, now it's swimming. And then, in no clip, you press K and you go to the center. Um, so, if there's that. So, I'll show not all, but some really cool things you can do. I'll go through all of these. Super Mario Maker. Alright, um, some of these are self explanatory. In fact, all of these first ones are self explanatory. Um, I'll start out with the test level. When you open it, it'll open up these two. You click on this, and then press Windows key right, and you'll this thing will uh, appear. Click Enable Test Level, minimize this. Uh, current level is zero, and then you can pick any level. Whoops. Pick any level, and you go to the test world. Um, it works with any character, for example, Tails, and you can even no clip here, go out here, slide. This, with this, you can also like force yourself to be any character. So, for example, I'll just set it, I'll do a simple one. Set it to zero. Go to Shadow's Radical Highway. You'll see Sonic Blue Sphere spinny thing. And then there's Sonic. And while I'm here, if you notice, Sonic doesn't have the thing on his other wrist, but he has one wrist. With that, you can go into one player character other thing and the upgrades fit field you can set it to whatever i'll set it to 15. so now i have like all of the upgrades well most of them as you can see not bouncy bracelet um let's try setting it to 16. i have the bouncy bracelet so you can just uh, set it to different things and you'll have different upgrades and whatnot and if you look over here on right one, there's that yellow thing set to 16, there's the green one. So it, it has different, you get different things. Um, Alright, um, horizontal speed. If you set that to zero, if you go really slow, set it to three, he constantly goes at that speed. Set it to 15. And I went underneath it. Okay. That makes, yeah, that makes sense. Um, I'll show one thing I like to do. Play with the Z, X, and Y. That wasn't the word press for me. Scale. So, X scale. Set it. I'll set it to zero. He's like, flat. I'll set it to negative one. He's at backwards. Which I find really cool. And even his shadow goes backwards. So then I'll set this one to negative one also. 
he's under the ground. So if you jump, he's like right there. Um, and then the Z scale, negative one. Yeah, nothing really. He's like mirrored, not really yeah. character ID. You can be what character and what stage. It's basically the player one character thing. Um, this one, I use these for multiplayer and then this for single player. Um, camera, you can lock the camera, play around with it. the two player and one player mode um, you'll notice for example Amy it says Amy 199 and Amy 21 um, you have to check both of them off and you have to set this first one to 99 whatever it says in the parentheses and if you set that one to 1 then I'll show in City Escape it'll still have Sonic's blue thing right there but if you look at the life thing and then I'm Amy and then just follow the instructions to play as the characters there um, to get the two player sound effects and voices you set these to 90 and 90 um, yeah you'll have to reset the game like, like not go to game but like completely reset it or one thing you can do is two-player battle and just like go into press Sonic or whatever um, check uh, other stuff um, these are just some things like better graphics and two-player mode you set that to zero infinite cart boosting it's weird these two weird things um, you can just see what they do um, and then always load this is for basically like co-op mode in story mode for example um, I'll go to heroes um, so you have to check these off go to this and highlight all the numbers after the three and just fill in nine like make them 90s and then for this one is just 90-90. So, so you go to story mode, hero. You can, um, and then this is where the two player character thing comes in handy. You can just change that to whatever. Or if you want, go through the level as Sonic and Tails. The only thing is, um, if um, player two, like if player one gets a checkpoint save, and player and player two dies, player two goes to the beginning of the um, stage. And if you notice, Sonic was getting the rings, but Tails wasn't. They each have their own ring count. It's like in like multiplayer battling. Um, and then there's yeah, there's just a bunch of other stuff you can look at. Um, so that's it. Bye.